Mercy the Light shirt. What do you want to do on it? Oh, it's just the Boo Scout shirt. Right, so that logo, like, oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Hold the says, camera pointing to the oh, fucking like thing. <laughs> I don't know, I don't want you to fuck it, it says AK Boost God on the front. Well, next to your name, so it's probably the fucking uh, uh, These are fucking swimming shoes. <laughs> These are actually kind of fire. <laughs> they look comfy. Do you know about these new boosts? Somebody sent them because I went swimming in my shoes in Mexico. They're boosted shoes? They're for swimming, I guess. Are they boosted on no, your boost? Aqua socks? They're not boosted. Adidas, just walks, kidding, but Adidas water socks. Yeah, water socks. Okay. I just want to kick Abby with them. She's like, man. Oh shit, sorry. I didn't mean to do that. Miss your boost? No, I meant to kick you here. Uh, they squeak when you like a jump. They're like fucking like dolphins. Sounds like a dolphin. Let's we'll get an interview. <laughs> Why are you grumpy? I'm grumpy. You look on the wrong side of the I bed. haven't eaten. Do you want us to get you some peanut butter? Or you know, a rice I've crispy treat? Expanded my palate. Oh really? Since the yeah. four weeks that I've seen you? Yeah. Yep. What has it expanded to? I've been eating some waffles. I've been eating some waffles. I've been hanging out with Joe Dirt. <laughs> with and eating some waffles with him. <laughs> You're ridiculous. Uh, what kind of waffles? Whole grain. <laughs> yeah, spelt, spelt flour. Next door. Nice. The dragon. Nice. Just deleted all my footage from this morning. That's it. <laughs> yeah, including you laying on the towel. This is gonna be a brick archway. Oh, nice. Let's go just straight through. Yeah. And then when we go back to Mexico in January, we'll. Take that floor out and it'll just be fucking the same floor all the way through. Glass or what? No, just oh. open. Uh -huh. This will all be tattoo stations back here and then this will be the piercing place. This is all piercing right? Yeah, and I like stuff this wall, pull the insulation, and we'll put like, we're gonna put on these doors because there's a glass door back there too. Yeah. Vinyls. We're gonna do like, uh, like old Jerry. Like just line drawing stuff, just do like a big yeah. girl and like a big ship on the back one or whatever. Please. Boom! I was agreeing to Nikki's before anybody. <laughs> you know, Matt got super mad at me. He did. Yeah, he was like, <laughs> oh, thanks. He's like, you fucking hate me. I was like, I really didn't even think that you would want them. I know, and then I was like, I like got on as soon as you sent them to me. I like woke me up. I went on and got them. I didn't even think for two or three more hours that I should have sent it to Matt. Yeah, yeah. And then I was yeah, like, by the time oh, you did, fuck, it was done. They were gone. He <laughs> put Justin on the blog. Yeah, Justin. International male model Justin Pierre. <laughs> uh, Are you still? You're not in Wellington anymore, though. Charlotte. Oh, okay. How's that going? Charlotte. Yeah. 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 Like Busy. Busy. What time is it? Five ten. Tom. Oh, Tom. Nice. Yeah. That's awesome. Hell yeah. That dude's fucking a ripper. You going tanning right now? In the sun. Oh. Real tanning. Oh. Uh, OG tanning. Yeah, like, like the real one. Right. Have fun. Bye. See you tomorrow. Will you? Well, probably not. What kind of towel is this? Huh? It's not a beach towel. No. That's what I thought we got. Can you dry yourself off with that? I, I could. Does it wrap around your waist? Yeah, yeah. Vegas says it will wrap around his. It'll wrap around my waist. No. Don't wrap around my waist. Yeah, this... I ain't gonna stay on. Yeah, it is. Look at nah, that. Nah, you'd be poking out. Oh, yeah. Me a little. yeah, you ding dong poke out of that. For sure. Pretty beach ready already? Yeah, it's yeah. not. No, it's. Oh wait, I got the perfect thing for you since you're at the beach. Oh shit. The water socks plug. <laughs> I can't believe you said that. <laughs> oh, those, those are comfy. Those are comfy. If those are comfy, they'd be sapphire. The stripes across the foot. Oh, oh take these. Borrow a few bucks. Break the water socks. How many do you need? Like 10? I only have hundreds on me actually. <laughs> <laughs> Pinky ring problem. <laughs> My new statement is pinky ring problem. It's a pinky ring problem. Oh. You know what's a pinky ring problem? Deleting all your goddamn footage from the fucking beginning of the day. I had a great rant. A great. Nah, because I was going through deleting old footage, and I just like stopped paying attention, and I deleted it all. And had a really good rant about getting ripped off because I've now paid over twelve hundred dollars for renting our fucking bicycles in London. <laughs> What? Yeah, I, every day I wake up, there's another charge on my account from what? us renting fucking bikes. We rode them, we rode them down a hill. We literally rode them down a hill it to go says, get dinner. It says the first 30 minutes are free. You run your credit card and you return the bike to a fucking stall. Any stall within 30 minutes is free. Code you put in, you like, use this little pay area. You write your card and you get a code, and then you put the code in. And it tracks it. And you put it back in, you just hit lock, and it turns it and locks it. 
Somebody didn't lock theirs or everything. No, locked. they locked. They all. I, I locked mine. I locked mine. Mine locked. I don't. Someone your brother. Did it because I was saying red man locked, and someone's like, no, green man locked. And so not everybody did uh, the same thing. I right. jiggled it. it I jiggled it too. Did I can't confirm out. that I, I jiggled mine. mine. But I'm pretty red. sure. It's coming back. I can't I coming back. I can't <laughs> confirm that I jiggled it, but Green I know that I locked go. it. It was 160. When I call them, it's just like a bunch of bullshit. So I had to call my fucking credit card company this morning and cancel all my cards, file claims, do all this shit. Because they're a company a fucking pain in the ass to deal with. And then people even on Twitter are like, they'll give you your money back, but it's going to take you like 30 days at least. I'm like, I don't got time for this shit. I got like $1,200 of my well, money. $1,200. Yeah. No, and that just, bike ain't worth $1,200. No, the bike's worth fucking $12. Yeah, like, you think someone was watching? I I think so. I think a local local was watching us. I'm sure somebody's figured out that. I'm pretty like, sure that kid flips those bikes. Know to Tourists know how to do it. And they flip yeah. those bikes. Yeah. They're like, there he goes. There's another one. Yep. <laughs> with, go get him. Go get him. Just chilling. He's are mine. I figured. Those aren't yours. No, those are yours. Oh. <laughs> What are they doing here? They're just chilling at Sab's house. Left them here? Why are they at Sab's house? Because you gave them to him in Boston. Oh. They're probably in one of these boxes. The finish line box yeah. with the Trace Pinks. Yeah. I got shoes at Rick's. I got shoes at yours. Your house. I got shoes here. There's a ton of shit going on today. A ton of shit. I got a ton of packages I haven't even been able to open yet. I got to call and get renter's insurance. I just had to turn the power on. I got to get movers. Schedule this pod for tomorrow. Make sure everything's cool with the apartment. Uh, pretty much everything. Right now, I gotta call and get insurance. A bunch of shoes to open, though. So that's cool. And there's even more shoes at Sager's house that I haven't unboxed. And there's basically shoes scattered all over the fucking place. So it's gonna take me a couple days to get my my bearings straight. All states renters insurance. Just so you know, we may monitor. I do not. I can't. Million dollar question, really, because I don't know. I have, um, I have like a pretty extensive shoe collection. On the personal property bill is ten thousand. Okay. Um, and then sometimes it's cheaper if you go with fifteen. Um, so I can just give you those two quotes if those seem those, like a reasonable amount. Yeah, those aren't anywhere um, close to so high enough. It's got to be worth at least a hundred thousand dollars, if not double, triple that. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, what kind of shoes? Uh, all Adidas. What do you mostly? All uh, Adidas? Yeah, it's every Adidas. That's all I wear. I don't like fuck with Nike or Jordan at all. Yeah. Um, the old. They're not really that they're old. It's they're, they're just rare. So, do you know what Boost is? Boost. Yeah. So, I have probably the biggest yeah. collection, at least one of the biggest collections of Boost in the world. So, the shoes haven't been out for more than like four years, really. You know, but I have. Yeah. Probably the biggest, you know, some would argue the biggest and say most impressive collection. There's a couple other guys that have some yeah. pretty big ones too, but um, but it's I didn't know Boost was, uh, collected like that. Yeah, I'm people. Not, not yeah, people, so. it's kind of re-sparked. You know, like a lot of us that collected Jordans and other stuff like Nike SB. I feel like it's re-sparked. Yeah. It's re-sparked that kind of like rabidness because it's something new and it's something cool and it's comfortable and everybody is kind of over Jordan and Nike and. Nike gets kind of like whacked yeah. out, Jordan kind of whacked out, so it kind of like is the yeah, resurrection for everybody. They're like, oh shit, I can actually, there's actually something cool to be into again, you know what I mean? So, insurance is handled. Let's see what else we got to do. Ugh. You can't, uh, but that breeze fucking my guts. I bet you, uh, that's yeah. your $500 you can't drink a gallon of milk. Not in like a, and I'll like buy a the milk. fucking chug. In two hours. No, I can't drink a gallon of anything in a chug. Two dude. hours, dog. Two hours, no. 500 bucks. I get so gassy. I like, throw up. I have to hold it all in? Huh? It's not. Two hours or one hour? I don't think it's possible in two hours at all. Really? I'll Google that shit. Milk chug, that's what, that would be your new nickname everywhere. <laughs> And that, so, uh, yeah. yeah, it's a pretty good one. I have you a gift. I have you a gift. <sighs> oh, shit. oh, damn! Yeah. Thanks, Teddy. You like this? One? Yeah. Oh, damn. Like this one? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just like that. Yeah. Like yours. Mine's just a little bit bigger. Mine's just a little bit bigger. I was in there bartering like a motherfucker, son. I just kept picking them up and I was like, all right. 
How much if I get these? Uh, how much if I get all these? <laughs> yeah, that's Wait, what? Oh, shit. That's Dang. basically a promise ring. Look at that, dude. That's <laughs> <laughs> sweet, dude. Thank yeah, you. Yeah. Say, here we go. That's for the shot. Oh, shit. That's tight. I feel like we need more stuff, right? Yeah. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Thing's cool. Oh, nice. That's cool. Well, sure, it's cool. Bad music playing in the background. Hey, don't talk about but, a girl like that. but he said the sugar skulls shirts restock tomorrow. So wait, we're having a drop tomorrow? Yeah, right now. Huh? The drops tomorrow? Yeah. Saturday the signature shirts? Oh shit. That's all tomorrow? Huh? That's all tomorrow? Signature versus white. Sugar skulls, Godzilla restock. Oh wow. What's up? Chillin'. Well, not, not really, actually. That's a bold face lie. I'm doing adult stuff all day. You got a test print? I'm working out the blur. Hell yeah. Why are you asking me? <laughs> shirts to count. You got shirts to count? And I got work to do. So there's a drop tomorrow. Godzilla restock. Some Sugar Skull shirts. The blur shirt, Mercy the Light shirt, all kinds of stuff. How's it going? Good, are you? Good, good. Why are you always Ch wearing this fucking trash movie shirt? Get your fucking oh. stupid pointy ass finger out of oh. my shit. Oh, ah. Quit. <laughs> you have jaw sheets? Uh, yeah. Do <laughs> they have a boat that the beer good. that uh, he drinks in the movie <laughs> to try and get it? But it's the only East Coast beer. What is it? I don't remember. We should order it for him. <laughs> So like their Santa, you know what? I like their Santa a lot better than actually. I like a picture of him. He's probably like a blonde. You know how hard it is to wrangle twelve kangaroos to pull a sleigh. Whiskers Yeah, whiskers are kids. Yeah. yeah. We choose anymore because Sager. Fucking, I've been gone. Sager's already got all these. I've seen these already. I saw. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I swear I'd get one pair of uh, fucking boots, and yeah. now my like Google uh, now is flooded with all your shoes. ads. Yeah. This shoe. <coughs> looks like it's made that out of soul. Like, uh, it's weird. Yeah, it's all like jelly. Crit. Yeah. Crit. Well, it gl the whole thing glows in the dark. Really? Yeah, the whole shoe. Dude, you like, should have worn it to the Grumio show. Crit. <laughs> I should have worn it to the show you went to. <laughs> Come on, dude. With three blending yeah, jars and six drinks, Tahiti yeah. offers all the capacity and versatility you need to serve a crowd. Oh, wow. Wait, we're really buying one of these? I bought it. It'll be here tomorrow. So make sure you come with a fucking fully camera. You just got your charge camera. camera. You guys talk about it. It'll look a little more red today because you're. Everything. So you need to like this. Yeah. Bring my shoes over to the apartment. I said, uh, in my truck. Yes. You think they're gonna fit in my truck? Yes, because they fit on the way out. No, there's 40 more pairs now. Oh. Can you start bringing them over? Start bringing them over. I feel like we should just get a U-Haul or really? two people. Or maybe Rick can help. We should rent, you think we really need to rent something to get them? Maybe. Like a little box car. Holy shit. You're the best. Get, get you a Sager, guys. <laughs> Gotta get you a Sager. Get these things done. Gotta get you a Cody. Get you a Sager, and then Sager gets him a Cody, and it's, it's all kind of downhill. You know? Cody makes the world go around. It's a graph. You've been missing out on Cody. Have I? I've been sleeping on Cody. Found him. Watch the crab. <laughs> what the fuck? Got mixed up in one of the one of the shots that we did. Had kind of a rough day. Sega was in such a good mood. I got home. All right, see you in the morning. We're leaving the shop now. This sab slab.
Sab slab. And the sab slab. Hopefully getting a new slab soon. Damn, fam, I remember when you got this car. I know. Growing up. Baby boy's growing up, what are you gonna get? I don't know, grandma wants to kick down some money. Grandma kicking down the funds. So grandma coming off the ends. So my boy could get a Benz. Mm -hmm. Grandma paying the tolls so I could buy the rolls. Grandma, grandma knows I need the ladies, so she got me the Mercedes. Ladies just graduated from DU on Saturday. Man, don't be fucking up my rhymes with your goddamn Baby, monogamy, all right? Rhyme out here, trying to get this album popping. Trying to outsell, trying to outsell your boy, Yachty. Little Yachty? Yeah. Bro, so you gotta come through with the teenage emotion. <laughs> Little Yachty? Hey, I ordered a package from him. Oh yeah, the box set. Yeah, and I was expecting the grill by my birthday. Yeah, grill on back order? Fucking till like goddamn July. I'll be lucky if I have it by July 4th. Wait, you got everything else though? No, oh, no, I didn't the get it. The whole anything. package? The whole package is on fucking back order. That's like, not good. I can, yeah. I can only defend my man so much. Got hey my man, own little Gotta coat. get your own wave. <laughs> Flavor wave. I don't know, I don't know. I feel like Lily Yachty would beat out Playboy Cardi. No. Oh. Or not Playboy Cardi, uh. Bird. Beat him up in a fight? No, no. Mm -hmm. In album sales. Man. Nah, I don't know about that one. Uzi's got better beats. Yeah. Little Yachty just needs to hook up with those Outkast dudes. They're from, they're from Atlanta. <laughs> if Little Yachty and Outkast got a fucking song together, the goddamn internet would fucking catch on fire. I'd be like, I don't even know what that'd be like. Fucking Jordan's drop a boost on him. People would be like, ah! <laughs> All right, so I just today's been crazy. I just got back to my hotel and I got a call from my leasing office for tomorrow that just told me that they just got a call saying that I owe money to an apartment complex from like six years ago, which I don't owe them, but it might stop me from moving into my apartment. My stuff is literally going to be outside of their place tomorrow morning, like in uh, 14 hours. So now I'm on the phone with the collection agency trying to get this shit done for tomorrow. Have no idea what's going to happen. Not in the best mood right now. So I'm um, going to try and figure this out and that's about it for my night. Today has been absolutely crazy. Vacation is officially over for sure. It's just shit flying everywhere, man. I'm going to show you guys these shoes real quick. I brought one pair of shoes with me. There's a ton of shoes still coming. Like not, well, there's still some stuff coming, but most of the stuff that came while I've been gone on this last leg of tour is still at Sager's house. I basically have shoes everywhere and I have to figure out how to get them all into one spot. But as soon as we do, and as soon as we get this apartment situation figured out, we'll, you know, uh, do it. So but right now I have to deal with this, unfortunately. So I'm gonna go deal with it. We're dropped tomorrow. We're dropping Godzilla, Blur shirts, Mercy of the Light shirts, and what's left over from New York Sugar Skulls. That's tomorrow at 8 p.m. on boost-heaven.com. If you want a shirt, grab one. Hopefully I'm still alive by then because I feel like I'm about to lose my mind. This is I need this I need it tomorrow morning. I'm not gonna write you guys a check right now for thousands of dollars that I don't owe, and you guys aren't gonna give me a receipt right away. I need a receipt right away. I looked for this account for one thousand eight hundred fifty four dollars. Jesus. For money I don't even owe. Do I get to counter offer that? Do I get to say fifteen hundred? get this over with i just want to let you know i know you don't care and i know this isn't your fault but i don't want to pay this money <laughs> not one bit i do understand uh, I, I i do acknowledge your uh, uh frustration on this account so as far as shoes go i got a bunch of shoes in the mail we didn't get a chance to take a look at all of them today because it's just too much it's absolutely too much um we'll get to it i'll get to it day by day these days are a little stressful Hopefully I can keep the vlog going and not completely lose my mind. But to talk about shoes, we did get the Nemesis Tango 17 Plus 360 Agility Boost shoe. Uh, this is a very not light shoe, I feel like, by the masses. Um, there's supposedly only 2,000 pairs of the shoe. I really don't know if that number is true. I never really know if these numbers are true when people are like, throwing around how many pairs there are, but that's what they said. I don't really know. But the shoe is based off an indoor soccer shoe, the Tango, uh, it just has a boost version. And then this new, uh, from what I read, this is called Agility Knit. 
So I don't really know what that means. Uh, I can say that it's not really like prominent whatsoever. It's a lot stiffer. It's kind of like an elastic that has embroidered black knitting on top of it. It definitely is not as flexy as prime knit. Not even close. Totally different feel. But uh, yeah, so the 360 agility bandage system that they've also called this uh, is super supportive. Like this shoe is super solid and very supportive and not really crazy sock-like. You know, it just doesn't, it has the sock feel like it's laceless, it's slip-on and all that, but it doesn't have the same texture and feeling. It's definitely a little more rigid. The inside is pretty enforced. You have, you're not gonna be able to see this, but there's definitely panels on the inside enforcing the shoe, especially in the heel area. The insole does not come out, it's just printed on the inside. Uh, so size-wise, I say true to size for sure. Sizing down in this does not, is not something I don't think I could do because when you take a step on this, it doesn't really give the way that Promnet does. So I feel like if you were really sized down on it, it would just be very uncomfortable. That's just me, I don't really know, but from what I'm guessing, I wouldn't really, I don't think I'd like it. But basically all white upper with black stripes kind of zebraed in. A lot of people are calling this a zebra colorway. So we'll call it a zebra, it's okay. Heavy on the three stripe branding, three stripes all on every panel, three stripes going, three stripes on the sides, uh, ultra boost cage or ultra boost heel cup with white on white ultra boost branding, boosts, white continental sole, of course. Um, yeah, these, I mean, they're super sick. I think these are a must cop. I mean, we don't have any shoes that look like this. A lot of people don't like the way that these look. Um, I think they're inspired by bandages that are used on soccer players' feet. Don't know if that's actually true or not, but I think that's what I heard or read somewhere. You have stitching that comes across the front of each shoe, so each panel is like stitched together and you can really like see the stitching. I never noticed that in the stock photos or anything and super cool definitely not a shoe that everybody can wear i mean not everybody can be able to pull this off that's for sure um, a lot of people will think it's too crazy and too wild i happen to like it i think it's cool if this came out in like a black colorway i'd be all over it as well um, i really like all the soccer stuff they're doing like just taking the soccer stuff and putting boost on it probably some of my favorite models right now like the a16 which i have plenty coming i have two pairs of those coming uh the flamingos from kith and then there's a white sample pair that I need to get checked out that's at Sager's house, but I just gotta get to everything, like I said. And then comfort-wise, I mean, they're super comfortable. Like, very comfortable shoe, the boost, and then the, the amount of support you get in the upper that's holding your foot on top of the boost, which is kind of what I think like the real secret to boost shoes are, is the upper support holding your foot in place so that you can really connect to the, the Oh my God, it's been a long day. To the boost or the sole of the shoe. Um, so I think that's a big deal. I do think these are super comfortable. I don't think they're for everybody, but I really like them. So if you're looking to cop, cop, probably gonna pay resale at this point. No idea if there's any future releases, but I don't have to worry about it. So, all right. But yeah, this is the uh, Nemesis Tango 17 uh, Integrity, is that what it's called? <laughs> Agility, the agility boost, not integrity boost. I'm sure integrity boost is coming, but yeah, this is the uh, Tango, Tango 17.1. Is it point one? Whatever. This is this is the Nemesis.
So I just got done eating the salad, finally. So happy to be back to salads, because I ate like shit for like weeks, maybe even months now. So full on salad kick is back in effect. If you see me eating anything else, just come and talk shit to me, I guess. Just paid off a charge, it's not even supposed to be on my credit. Had no idea it was on my credit, but it's on my credit. And so I just got done paying off. We wanted $2,600. I just gave him $1,500. Pains me to even say this. $1,500 so that I can hopefully get a receipt showing that I paid it so I can hopefully move into this apartment tomorrow. So everybody, please send as many good vibes as you can that this all works out or else your boy's homeless and I'm going back on the road. I don't even know what. I'm just, I'm, I'm, I, don't, I don't feel like dealing with this right now. So hopefully tomorrow everything goes smoothly. I'll let you know tomorrow. But before I go and uh, smoke like 30 joints to try and deal with the ridiculousness that's been my day because only a portion of it has been filmed. It's been probably top five frustrating days of my life so far. Yeah, probably. But I wanted to say shout out to my man at Private Label for sending me over a bag. Um, these are super sick. I've been meaning to pick one of these up for a while. Uh, finally, you know, homie, my man said that he was going to send me one, so I've been waiting. It got here, this is the colorway that I wanted, so I think he was just waiting to get them back. Ugh, waiting to get them back in stock. But these are super dope. I'm sure a lot of people have reviewed them. I haven't had a chance to review it yet. Uh, here's my aqua socks that are in here still. Shout out to the homie for these. These are these are hilarious. I love these. But if these had boost on them, they'd be fire. Not that they're not fire, but you know what I'm saying. In my uh, stuff, I bought a Sager's brother. I bought a Nintendo Twitch Switch. What is it? Switch. I got a Nintendo Switch now too, so uh, probably could have used this with all the air travel I was doing, but now I have one for the new apartment that we're going to get tomorrow. So, Twitch, I got that. It's what actually comes in the bag. So they have these separate panels. You can like panel out the inside of the bag so you can put your shoes down into it and have everything be organized. They're super dope. Um, I don't quite know what this thing is yet. I'll have to look into this. I really don't have time to look into everything. But separate pockets, you know, different zipper pockets, stuff like that. These are super sick. A lot of people use these. Like Wex uses one. A lot of a lot of dudes who travel with shoes use these. I know a lot of my followers have bought them. I've signed a couple, I think. But uh, yeah, these are super dope. If you haven't heard, private label. And I'll give you a full review. Like, I'll take this to Dallas or something and buy with it, road test this bad boy and give you a full review of it, man. Shout out to Private Label if you're looking for one. Uh, these are the, you're looking for a shoe bag, these are the guys. This is kind of like the only shoe bag really on the market that's worth it to me. So that's where I would go. Yeah, that's the day, man. I'm going to go and rest and hope for the best tomorrow. So, see you guys soon. Hey.